this video, we're going to look at the difference between a case and a simple requirement. So I'm going to open a recent client, um, so we'll say Mr John Smith here. And this is going to take me to his client summary dashboard. So you're able to see information that I've input about this client. So you've got your personal details and your financial details. I've also done a couple of cases and a couple of requirements for this client. The difference between a case and a requirement is that a requirement is in a very initial source. So you're just getting together an idea of what the client is after, um, indicative figures and an idea of rates. And then a case is when you assign that requirement, so if the client would like to go ahead with it, um, whether it's a mortgage or protection or both of them, to a fact find and then attaching some of the documentation to that case. So if we go and look at a mortgage and protection case that I have done, you can see that I've done a mortgage and protection quote. I have a checklist with outstanding documentation here. However, if I select completed, it shows me the documentation that I have uploaded onto the system. If I go back to my client summary page here, and if I open a requirement, if we select this one, you can see that it takes me immediately to the source site rather than the case. So there's do no documentation associated with this requirement. And that is the difference between the two on Xplan Mortgage.